definitely influenced by, well, I'll talk about the musicians first because that's a big thing. Um, but I'm really influenced by old jazz, like Ella Fitzgerald, Sarah Vaughan, Billie Holiday, um, you know, all those greats who did the, the jazz standards. And yeah, I really, I love like the swing that goes into that music and the style, like it just feels like magic when you listen to it, it takes you back to another time and sometimes I feel like I'm not of this time period, like I really like that music from like late 50s, early 60s. Um, I'm also really influenced by some modern music like Radiohead and um, Fiona Apple, singer songwriter um, Lately I've been really into Brandy Carlisle. Like, I like music of a lot of different styles, but the most important thing to me is that it, it's conveying something emotionally and that there's some genuine feeling or artistic intent that it's going towards. Like, I don't really relate to music that's just made to be commercial or to sell a lot of uh, records. Like, I don't really listen to the radio, it just doesn't do it for me. So I'm working with a, a sound recorder that I met through uh, Duquesne, he used to go there. His name is Darren Diedrich, um, he has a home studio in Pittsburgh, and um, yeah, I just told him I was interested <laughs> I in recording some of my original music, and we got some other musicians from Duquesne University involved. And it's been a really awesome experience just hearing everything come together because it sounds really different when I'm just at home on the piano by myself hearing my music versus other musicians kind of taking it to the next level. Like everything just sounds so much more um, alive when you put percussion and piano and bass into it. It just changes everything in a really awesome way. When I was recording Down the Drain, um, like when I played it alone, it was it's, it was very simple. And it's, it's still a pretty simple song overall, but when other musicians played it, it had more of this like really cool swing alternative feel to it. And that wasn't even necessarily what I originally intended, but I really liked it. And I think I'll probably end up incorporating some of that into my live performances. I love performing, it's just such a rush. It makes me really nervous beforehand, but once I'm up there, it just, it's surreal. Like, it just feels like you're bearing your soul. I know it sounds a little cliche, but it really does feel like that for me.